Why hello everybody and welcome back to the second part of Final Fantasy XV bonus series. So today we are going to take on another dungeon that is located down here. I forget what it's called. But we're going to go down there and uh, pay the visit. So uh, I'll meet you all there in just a second. Because there's no point in making you guys sit for the drive. Okay everybody, so we have finally reached our destination here. Um, appears to be a mine site. And uh, what does this guy say for us? Dangerous and demons, vicious varmints, and yeah. Okay, so all of like the dangerous uh, dungeons, I guess, are marked with uh, these guys. So you know that they're post-game if they have that little symbol on it. So <clears throat> let's do this. The Blue Mines is what it's called. Wow, that might be the oldest elevator I've ever seen. Might still work. Going down. Are you sure this thing can hold all of us at the same time? We can only hope. Our goal? To defeat the monster in the innermost sanctum. Well, that's just what I'll do. Try not to get lost. You get lost. Look at his face. So beautiful. So dirty. Uh, all aboard, huh? What? Afraid it can't take our weight? More likely to become stuck. I can live with stuck. This thing's been around a while. I can only guess when they began mining here. You know what sort of place this is? The sort that's infested with bloodthirsty demons. Am I warm? Red hot, I'd say. Give me a break. Well, there's no telling how deep the shaft goes. Ooh. All the way to hell. <clears throat> you know what they say, right? Keep your feet and arms inside the shuttle at all times. He you did not do that. Bit of a shot in the dark, <coughs> don't you think? We'll see. We'll see what's here. Because I feel like there's going to be things inside this this mine shaft. Now, it's either just going to be more items that you can get, or it's going to be an actual thing. We'll see. We'll see. Ooh, what's the rainbow pendant? Uh, rainbow pendant. With the motif protects away from confusion. Oh, and this one protects away from petrification. Interesting. So I have a feeling we're gonna have to deal with a Ronin, or sorry, not a Ronin, um, one of those witch ladies Whoa. that. Uh, Anyone hear that rumbling? Something's coming towards us. Ah, whatever it is, it's moving pretty damn fast. From behind, look out! Yeah, you're a little late there, Gladio. I doubt the cart started rolling on its own. Something or someone. Ooh, that son of a bitch. This is so funny, huh? Huh, little goblins playing a little trick on me? Little bastard. Freaking kill you, son. Kill you dead. Um, uh, so that looks like a extra gate or something that there could possibly be something behind. And this just goes down, right? Because that's its own separate pathway that leads towards the basement, I'm assuming. I'm assuming, yeah, I think that leads towards the bottom floor. So it's like, do you want to go in, go straight to the bottom right off the bat? Or do you want to work your way down? So we'll see what this area is, though. I'm kind of interested. Okay, no cart. Awesome. Okay, so let's go down then. We're going to work our way from the top to the bottom here. <coughs> It'll probably get progressively harder as we go on. So first we start with level 7s. It's going to be level 20s. And by the end of it, we'll be dealing with level 50s. Ooh. Okay. He's dead. And he's dead. Oh, indeed it would be nice to brighten things up. But sadly we can't. Indeed. Right. Again? He's dead. <clears throat> Just like so. So what is this way though? Another mine cart. Jesus, that guy actually got me over there. Scared me. Pooped him. I pooped him. That's weird. The hell? 
Okay, let's go the other way. Let's go, guys. Come on. <clears throat> I'm assuming this path leads back to the elevator. Again, I honestly, I feel like this is just like a gauntlet dungeon where you get, where you fight stronger and stronger enemies or something. Ramshackle, to say the least. Yeah. With plenty of nooks and crannies for things to jump out at you. Yeah, it is. Okay, cool. So we could, but we won't bother with that. So. I was also kind of thinking that maybe like the elevator is like a progression thing where it's like each one is locked and the only way you can access it is by going down to that floor and working away to it and then unlocking a door. So that's what I was kind of thinking originally with the elevator. So, but I guess not. I guess it's just, you know, do you want to start at the beginning or do you want to just finish off the guy because you're already high enough level? Come on, cards again? Really? That's how you're gonna do it, game? Okay then. Well, it doesn't don't even have to worry about much here because they're all dead, so. Let's go. Yep. That little shit. Thinks he can knock me down and, not, and get away with it, huh? No repercussions. Teach him a lesson. Still have a ways to go. Yeah. Someone's a fan of ventilation. Oh, please shut up, Gladio. No one wants to listen to that type of stuff. Come on, just die. There we go. Yeah. 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 Look where you're going. Oh, sorry about that. I believe this ladder is already extended, right? Okay. I mean. Okay, not another generator system. I'm assuming this door is going to be locked. Oh no, this gate is open. Okay. Let's be done with this rift route. Okay, there's quite a bit of guys in there. What? Okay. <coughs> Back to it. All those old goblins just kind of crumbled or crunched up in there. I mean, I don't really know where I'm going all that much. Okay. It's a big place. What do you make hey, I remember Time him. To settle the score. Yeah. Oh, really now? You think he, you can take me on, pal? Let's see. So... How good is this blade? This blade does 900 and... But I feel like the Blade of the Father is much better. Let's switch over to Gladio as well. Why? Because Gladio is much more fun to play. Much more skill based too. Boom, boom. Ooh, okay. See, a little bit more difficult too. <clears throat> oh, and he is dead. Eat doo doo. Cause he's dead. Have a look around. Oh, awesome! Did I glitch myself up a level? I don't know. Maybe I didn't. Right. No, I didn't. Okay. Thought maybe I was able to like teleport up a level by accident. That would've been pretty cool. 
Um. <clears throat> nope, no breaking that guy. But I can almost guarantee it's gonna fall down, just like my controller is right now. Jesus criminy. <laughs> oh man, sorry about that. Oh, having a cold sucks. <sighs> okay. Let's go, 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 boys. Go, go, go. Indeed. Um. Can I please climb the ladder? Thank you very much, sir. Uh, see what's up here, if anything. Okay. Keep going higher and higher. <coughs> And where are we? Okay, some more goblins. He's dead, just like so. There we go. Come on. I'm here to explore and find everything. I think it's both. Enough talk. Time yeah. for some action. Oh, get wrecked, son. Got ourselves some gold ore. Uh oh, this one card's coming right down. Nice try, the little goblin. Yeah, I know, pal. You're, again, a little late. <coughs> Come on. Even you can come in handy. And even you can be annoying. Of course he can be ignoring. That's his whole shtick. And on we go. Oh hey. Look where we are now. We're back here. That's cool. Um I mean let's check out this path, see where this leads. like we're exploring the mine forgotten by time. This place is so old, I'll be surprised if there isn't treasure here. Guys, there we go. No use hanging around here. Indeed. Okay, so we still got another mine shaft here. Huh. We're gonna have to take something up from like a bottom floor and bring it down here no I don't think so this game isn't that intelligent um oh <sighs> let's see here so we came this way so we have to go back now oh do not notice this before Gladly take that on my journey to try and craft the world's strongest potion. And then, what way did we came from this route, right? Yeah, okay, we came from here. So then we have to go to the right this time and see what's going this way. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! Uh-oh. Oh. Okay, so we're just back here. <clears throat> so, nothing interesting. Cool. Good to know. Good to know. I didn't waste my time with that. What is this? 
Well, we got a little thing here. An elixir. Huh. And then we, uh, I believe we should also have something up here, I feel. Oh, yeah. Right there. Obviously, you can't have something in an area like this without an item behind it. So, we're going to head over this way. Because we need to go back. And I guess instead of going downwards, just go forwards. And also, we didn't pick up this item, it seems. And also, I guess this is a dead end. <coughs> Nothing that way. Something this way, but we're going to have to fight enemies for it. Up oh, now we're good. <sighs> this looks like a mine, like an elevator shaft or something. But, great. Okay, then. I already know what the title of this part's gonna be. Colds suck. Oh, is there nothing over off in this direction? No, there doesn't seem to be. Okay. There's an item there, I believe, which I'm not gonna bother with. Just because I'm not gonna go for, like, any special achievements or freaking stupid stuff that requires you to pick up everything. That'd be hell on earth. Almost 99. I'm going to create the strongest triple cast spell there ever did was. Almost killed them all with one hit. And on we go. Right. Okay. I guess there's nothing there, but I feel like there will be. We're going to hit a button that's going to drain out the mines or something. It's like what all these ventilation shafts are. It's like, it's actually all just one big, like, waterway drainage system. Oh, and the road split. Oh, great. But they reconnect, so that's fine. Hey, you want to watch where you're going? Oh, shut up, Gladio. First off, you're in my way. Come on. Boy, yeah. You should have taken up fencing. Indeed, maybe you have. Maybe you should have, you know? That'd be kind of cool. Having a fencer character who uses like a... What are they called? Um, I don't know. A long straight sword, I guess? Let's oh, Jesus. Right. Oh. Oh, no oh, screw this game. Screw this game. Um, That was a bullshit oh scare. Oh, wow, yeah, there really is a lot of water in this area. So I do feel like there's going to be something huh. along the lines of, like, unflooding this tomb or something. <clears throat> oh, what is this? Is this a fire? Oh, no, that looked like a firestone or something. I was going to be, like, super happy. Boom, boom. Dead before they could even do anything. This place gives me the chills. Hmm. Shudder to think how far underground we are. Huh. I guess we're going this way regardless of whether or not we want to. Done here. Wanna check another floor? Yeah. We're gonna go down. Wait, what? Wait a minute, what is the map of this area currently like? Okay, so I didn't even fully explore this area yet. Okay, I gotta go. That's what I need to do. I need to come on. Let me up. Since when did they run away from us? Since they no good. It's locked. 
Oh my god, you little shits, you demons. You little shits, you know that? Holy crap, holy ravioli. Okay, so. I do dubly believe it is stuck. Yeah, okay, it's permanently stuck locked. Okay, so I'm going to quickly go back. Uh, I will see you guys in a minute here. Um, yeah. Uh, goddamn game. Okay, so what was the whole point of that? Why is it, is there something new this way now? Oh, what is this? Here we go. I didn't see this the first time. The way continues on. Oh. This is what we were looking for, isn't it? So this will either lead to the secret room, which it seems it does lead to the secret room. Ha, bingo! Makes the hassle worthwhile. Oh, here it is. Tomb of the Clever. Oh, we did it. Huh. Isn't that interesting? And what did we get? The crossbow, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Nice little upgrade to our rural arms collection. Look at that. Isn't that awesome? And then if we go up and over this way, I bet this is going to hold the secret door that we can't access yet. It does. Ooh, guys. No dice. Won't budge. Oh, there's actually a keyhole. I never knew that. Exists a key. Or like a magical key. That well then. Lock any door. Like from the video games. Guys, I guess that's that for this dungeon. I mean, I I'm going to keep it kind of relatively small because, again, I'm trying to move on to, like, this new uh, smaller formatted uh, video size. You know, it's so around 20 minutes. So this one actually works very well for that. The last part didn't really do too well, but that's because that, that uh, sewers one was actually a pretty big dungeon alongside the whole, you know, Adamantor's uh, tips and stuff. But... Anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video, and if you did, awesome, it means you did something right, and I enjoy that, and uh, yeah, I guess in the next one, we're going to head over to uh, Castle Rock, I believe it's called, it would be the next one that we can go to, um, so yeah, we're going to go to Castle Rock, which if you guys remember, we've actually been to that dungeon before, we just couldn't enter it, because we didn't know how, um, I tried like warping around and all that stuff, and turns out... Uh, yeah, we just have to wait till midnight because it was like a replica of a dungeon that we did later on in the game. So, uh, yeah. Um, so until then, guys, I hope you guys all have a great day. And uh, this is goodbye. So, see ya.